will walk through the principles of how to set up a virtual private network, VPN, using your home computer network. Windows 7 as the operating system. Your VPN procedure may be different based on your operating system. A VPN allows your laptop computer to use your home network while traveling. It creates a secure connection between your laptop computer and your home network. VPNs are frequently set up for businesses that have multiple office locations or employees who work from home. In this case, the VPN provides protected access to the company data no matter where the employee happens to be working. Employees can securely work from home, a hotel, or an internet cafe. Before you start building your VPN, you need to know your home router's external IP address. While at home, type in, what is my IP, in Google, and your public IP address will be displayed. Write this number down because you will need to know your home IP address when setting up your VPN. Before leaving your home for that business convention, you need to set up your home network so it knows to accept your laptop's VPN request. Setting up the VPN connection on your laptop will not work if your router denies the incoming request. Before leaving home, you need to configure your router. Begin by selecting the Start button in the lower left corner of the screen. In the search bar, enter the phrase Network and Sharing. Then select Change Adapter Settings. Once you have selected the Change Adapter settings, you need to create a new incoming connection. This tells your home router that it's okay to accept the VPN request from your laptop. You create this new connection by selecting File and then New Incoming Connection. When you have the New Incoming Connection screen open, you can add users that will be able to connect via VPN to your home network. This is a great time to not only add your laptop, but your tablet, smartphone, or even the devices of family members. Setting up all of your devices to easily connect to your home network through a VPN keeps your personal data secure. Once you've added all of your users and their devices, select Next. Then select Through the Internet and next again. The second to last screen will ask you which internet protocol you'd like to use. The default is set to use TCP IPv4, which is fine for almost all users. Once you've selected the users for your VPN and your internet protocol, you're almost done. Select Allow Access, and you've set up your VPN home network. Now, whenever you're traveling and want a secure internet connection, your home network is ready to accept your VPN. But wait, how do you reach that home network from your laptop? We've already seen how to set up your home network to accept an incoming VPN request and now we'll look at how to send an outgoing VPN request from your laptop. 
The easiest way to start setting up your laptop's VPN network in Windows 7 is by selecting the Start button on the bottom left corner of your screen. Type VPN into the search bar and then select Set up a VPN connection. Here's where you'll use the home IP address that you wrote down earlier. Make sure you take this number with you wherever you travel. In the Internet Address field, enter your home IP address. This tells the VPN connection where you want the connection to end up. For the purpose of this exercise, check the box next to Don't connect now, just set it up so I can connect later. Doing so sets up the connection instructions without actually connecting now. Next, you'll need to enter a username and password. This is for your home network. Because you want to access your home network from a different location, you need to enter your home network's username and password. Because you previously selected Don't Connect Now, you will see a Connect icon, which means your VPN is set up and ready to go. When you're away from home and need to initiate your VPN connection to your home network, the first step is to select the network icon in the taskbar. Your icon may look like a wireless or wired network. The connection process you followed earlier will be listed under Dial Up and VPN. Alternatively, you can also start this connection by first selecting your Network and Sharing Center and then connect to a network. Either option will bring up your VPN connection box where you will enter the username and password for your home network. After a few moments, your VPN connection should be up and running. You are now safely and securely accessing the Internet through your VPN. You have completed this learning activity, setting up your virtual private network.